Hi, this is Lenny from Free Market Media Group, and what I'm going to go over today is I want to show you how easy it is to add a custom menu to your navigation bar on your WordPress site. So let's take a look at what we have. This is just a uh, um, an install on a demo site I have, but what's going on here in the top navigation bar is it's showing all of the pages that have been created. And there might be times you're creating pages, you don't want them all to show up, and you want to have full control over what pages show up. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to the dashboard. I have this tab open. Go to the dashboard. We're going to navigate uh, first to Appearance. And then under the Appearance tab, we're going to go to Menus. And now in Menus, we don't have any created. But let's just show you what you're seeing. So under Menus, if we scroll down on the left-hand side, uh, you have Pages that you can select. And you go a little farther down, Categories. But I can't do anything with them now because I don't actually have a menu set. So the first thing you want to do is create a uh, is create a menu. So um, we're going to type in the name of the menu. So let's just call it main menu, uh, and you can call it anything you want. And click create menu. Now, once you've done that, you have the option. You can add a custom link in here if you wanted to link somewhere else. You can select pages, um, and you can select categories from your blog. But what we want to do is select some pages. So let's select a uh, contact page. Uh, actually, let's go to view all so we can see everything that's here. Let's select our home page and we want um, the blog page and a contact page. And then we'll add those to the menu. And what happens when you add those, um, it goes over on the menu side and you can drag and drop those and move them however you like. Uh, I typically like the home page on top and then the contact page as the last page. So home first, contact last, kind of bookends. That's just me, um, but I do think it's a pretty good system. So once you have the pages in there that you want, you've dragged them around and moved them where you want them to go, you just click Save Menu. Once the menu is saved, then you want to um, basically tell WordPress that you want where you want that menu to go. Now that top navigation bar that's actually is set up in most WordPress themes that will take menus as your primary navigation menu. So let's go ahead and click the drop down there, select Main Menu, click Save, and let's go back to our page here and uh, let's just do a refresh. And if we refresh, look, there are my three pages. So now, now let's say we want to add our services page there because we forgot to add it. So we just want to add one more page to our menu. Uh, we can go to View All again on the pages. So we went back to our Menus tab and we went to View All on our pages. Let's just scroll down. Uh, we don't have a services page. so. Let's quickly just add that page. Uh, it's a draft. So let's go ahead and go in there and publish a services page. And then we'll go back to Appearance and then Menus. Scroll down a little bit, go to our Pages. And let's see if it's in there. So the most recent services and let's add to the menu. And so now we don't want it to be last so we can click it and drag it click and hold and drag and then save the menu. Now let's go back to our page and refresh. And there you go. That's how easy it is to add new items to your navigation bar using WordPress menus. Hope that helped. Uh, if you got something out of this video, please comment below. Uh, give me a thumbs up. Thumbs ups are always good. And if you want to give me a thumbs down, go ahead and tell me why, because I'd like to know. And if you have any questions about WordPress, anything at all, go ahead and ask them here, because this gives me good ideas for future tutorials. All right, thanks. Again, this is Lenny from Free Market Media Group. Hope that helped. Have a great day.